All right, guys, we are back again at the family video. You're getting an early start because I have something specific I want to look for. So come with me. Let's find the movie. It is... Okay guys, before we even get started in here, let's take a look at what the new things are. Oh look, they got Frozen 2, which I don't really have an interest in in watching myself, but... And I love Jamie Lee Curtis, but I don't know, something about that movie, I'm really not interested in that either. Uh, let's see here. Spies in Disguise, that's something I would love right there. Charlie's Angels, uh, I don't know. Uncut Gems, I do want to see that one. What is this Inherit the Viper? Look, when I first looked at this, I was like, okay, that looks like Josh Harnett. And I haven't seen him in a movie for a long time. That is definitely him. I wonder if that's like that the uh, aging thing that they're using now, the aging process in movies. I'm definitely going to have to see that because I really like him as an actor, but not today. Today, we are looking for the original Ninja Turtles movie. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles from the 80s. I don't know if they're even going to have it in here, but I sure hope so. Alright, we'll start with the free kids movies. It could be over here. Where are the T's? S-T... Teen Titans? Holy crap, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, this is not it, but... Okay, not over here. It's a good start, though. We know that they carry Ninja Turtle stuff. And look at this. Bebop and Rocksteady. How cool is that? Okay, let's see. Let's go over and check. Let's check Family Fun first. Alright. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Look at this. Okay, we got batteries not included. Now, how many of you remember Batteries Still Not Included, the sequel, which apparently now, due to the Mandela Effect, no longer exists? I remember it distinctly because this one was awesome, and I was so excited when the next one came out, and it ended up sucking so bad, I think, that I didn't even watch the whole thing. Kind of like Jingle All the Way 2. Get out of here. <laughs> All right, let's go look. I didn't like Paul Blart 2 either. Usually the sequels are not very good for anything. Okay, here's the S's, except for the Santa Claus movies. I loved all those. All right, let's see. Oh, here we go, guys. Oh, my God. They have all three of them. And look, they even have uh, the newer ones. Okay, this is so cool, guys. Look at this. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This is the original one. Look at that. How can you not love that? If you didn't grow up with this stuff, you just totally do not understand. Look, Secret of the Ooze. Remember when Vanilla Ice did the ninja rap? Go, ninja, go, ninja, go. Look at that. All right, I'm going to get all three of them. Yes, look at that. So cool. The newer ones, I honestly don't remember. I think I've seen part of these. Um, I'll save those for another night. Out of the Shadows, that must be the sequel. I'm thinking there's a third one even, but I don't see it. And Maybe it's actually one that hasn't been released yet. I don't know. I don't remember. I'll have to look it up. But yeah, let's take these three and hit the road here. Alright, so cool guys. I am so stoked that they had all three. This is going to be an awesome night.
Okay, guys, let's go find our shirt first, and then we will swing over to the groceries and get the stuff for our snacks over there. I was kind of thinking either yellow or white. However, we haven't made a green shirt yet. Let's use green. Yeah, green is pretty turtly. I don't remember if we have any white letters at home. So let's grab a pack of those. And then the next thing we need to get is mason jars, glass mason jars for the snack we're gonna make, maybe down here. Yep, right here, okay. I believe this is the size we want right here, nine bucks. Wait a minute, what's this? 634 for the same thing. That's four, and look at this. Depending on how many people you're having at your movie night, they even have another pack. Only a couple dollars more, nine dollars for 12 of them, that same size. Cool. So let's go ahead and get these, and we'll head on over for the ingredients. This is gonna be tasty. Actually, I've never made these myself before, but they should be tasty by the time they're done. Can't imagine it's not going to be. Okay, the first thing we need is heavy whipping cream, and this should be enough right here. We need some unsweetened Hershey's cocoa. We need vanilla extract. Okay, we are also going to get some food coloring. I want green. Yep, it's in there. I believe that's actually all we need. The recipe calls for, like, this swerve stuff right here. But I've never used that. What I use is stevia right here, which is, you know, basically just the same thing, a, a sugar substitute. So we're going to stick to that this time. Because this stuff ain't cheap, man. That's like eight bucks a bag back there. So I just want a snack. <laughs> Look at this, guys. If you were not on a uh, on keto or low carbs or anything there are so many cool things you can do like look at this green gatorade green kit kats green jello green pudding look you could even be lazy you don't even have to make it strawberry kiwi uh green what is this stuff kool-aid gels holy crap you could make a cake with green icing green sugar cookies green yogurt and right now, because of St. Patrick's Day, look at this. Green milk. Mint vanilla. Oh my gosh, that would be good. Do you guys remember the uh, the Ninja Turtle Hostess pies? I think they had vanilla pudding inside and they had green icing. Oh my god, they were so good. I would murder for one right now. Turtle brownies. Turtle cheesecake. Turtle ice cream bars. ice cream check that out you could even make enchiladas with green chili sauce all right I got everything I need so let's get out of here green drinks the only thing that I need that I don't have is toilet paper because all these freakies bought it all thinking we're all gonna die I mean what's the thinking on that anyway if we're gonna die we're gonna die with a clean butt Okay guys, we are ready to make our delicious snack. Now we're gonna start with this tonight instead of the shirt because we have to freeze this for three hours. So we're gonna put this together first, stick it in the freezer, and then we'll make our shirt. What we're making tonight is delicious keto sewer sludge turtle ice cream. Actually, we're gonna make a couple of different flavors. We're gonna make vanilla and we're gonna make it green. And then we're also gonna try chocolate and we're gonna try chocolate with uh, keto chocolate chips in them. I've never tried this before, so you guys are trying this right along with me for the first time. The first thing we need to do is put one cup of heavy whipping cream in each of these jars. Okay, the next thing this calls for is a sugar replacement that you can use on keto, and I am using stevia. We're gonna use two tablespoons in each jar. 
Okay, next we're going to add a little bit of the unsweetened cocoa, just one tablespoon to each. And we're gonna do this in two of them because I wanna try one or just regular chocolate and then one with the chocolate chips mixed in as well. So there we go, and then we'll add a few of these chocolate chips to one. Okay, next we're gonna add vanilla extract. Just one teaspoon to each of these jars. Okay, so the last step is just to shake these up. Put the lid on nice and tight. And we're gonna put our green food coloring in these two after we shake them up. In fact, let's just see how these go first. <laughs> okay. Okay, I don't know. Let's see if we can put a little bit of green food coloring in these. Shake. Yeah, that's working pretty good. Maybe a little greener. Jeez, you get a workout in while you're doing this. Okay, so that looks good. Here's what they look like so far before we put them in the uh, freezer. Two chocolates and two sewer sludge. Okay, we'll leave those in there for three to four hours and uh, we'll get started on our t-shirt. Okay, so while that stuff's in the freezer, we are gonna make our shirt here. What I did was I took our white letters and I cut out all my letters. I had two sheets of the, uh, the transfer paper from last week, and this is what I put on it right here. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Check that out. That is totally awesome. This was actually drawn by my friend Leonard. He started a YouTube channel now, and if you want to check it out, I'll put the link below. He draws all kinds of comics and just awesome stuff. He's drawn me a couple pictures that I actually used to use in my intros and my videos and that. And uh, just, you got to check out the channel. I'll put the link below. And uh, his name is Leonard. Check him out. Tell him I sent you. We are about to put this picture right here on our awesome green Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles t-shirt. I think we do the picture first and then the lettering. Okay guys, there it is, Kawabunga, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Look at that, how cool is that? I messed up a little bit on the picture, you can see where it doesn't really match up in the front there, but it's not too bad. I had to use two pieces to make it as big as I wanted it, otherwise it would have been a lot smaller. But hey, for a homemade shirt, for a movie night, that is pretty sweet. Give me a second, I'm gonna change this shirt and we're gonna check our ice cream. Cowabunga! Turtle time! Okay guys, we got our Cowabunga shirt on here. I am so excited. 
I got, where did I put the movies? Oh, right here. We got all three movies ready to roll. And we're going to check our ice cream right now. Okay, now this stuff has been in here actually for probably five, six hours. There's our chocolates. And here's our green sewer sludge. Okay, I hope they have not been in there for too long. I don't think that's even possible. Look at that. There's one of the chocolates. I don't know if that's the one with the uh, chocolate chips or not. And here's the green stuff. That did turn out pretty good with that green food coloring. And it should just be vanilla flavored. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Let's give that a taste. Okay, actually, we're going to give each of them a taste. The chocolate and the green. Green, vanilla, whatever you want to call it. The sewer sludge. Let's do that one first. Yeah, I mean, it froze up pretty good. Look at that. And there's our little bite. Smells very vanilla-y. Mmm. That is actually really good. I mean, when you can't have ice cream because you're on keto, that is a very good alternative. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Turtley. All right, let's try the chocolate. Smells chocolatey. Yeah, look at that. Just like ice cream. Now that tastes just like chocolate ice cream that you would get out of the box, out of the carton. That is really good. And I think this is the one that has the chocolate chips in it because I can't see them on the top. But you can kind of see some dots down there. Well, no, I was wrong. There's bigger dots down there. <laughs> Alright guys, anyways... I'm going to get my sewer sludge here, I'm going to put on my movie, and I am going to enjoy a triple threat of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles tonight. Happy Saturday night snack and a movie. Come back every Saturday. Make sure you subscribe and check out Leonard's channel if you want to see him draw this shirt right here. I'll see you guys next Saturday. Peace.